Do you want to view E01 files? Install and run Sistool Free E01 Viewer. Welcome to Sistool C01 Viewer. The software helps you to preview Outlook SD, host and exchange EDB data from E01 file. Click scan to initiate the scanning of E01 file. Select the filters to view the required data. Select all option for scanning simultaneously EDB, PSD and host data. Select the only file type which are required to preview. Select file mode to select the single E01 file. Select the folder mode to select multiple E01 files simultaneously. Browse E01 file. Select the E01 file. Click open. Click OK. Click OK after successful scanning of E01 file. Select the data which you want to preview. The OST files are listed separately from E01 file. The Outlook PSD files are listed separately. The Exchange EDB files are also listed here. You can select particular host file to preview it emails and other data. Click View Content to preview the host file. By clicking this the embedded host viewer software open automatically. Explore the host file to preview its data. Select the email to preview. Preview email. Preview attachments of email. In same way you can preview calendars, contact, tasks, notes, Journal. Click Yes to exit host viewer. Now select and preview the Outlook PSD file. Click View Contents. Automatically the SysTool PSD viewer launches. Preview the selected email. Preview the selected email. Preview email. Preview attachment. In same way you can preview other item of PSD. Click exit. Click yes to exit the Outlook PSD viewer application. Now preview selected EDB files. Click View Contents. Select the folder to preview. Preview the EDB data. 
attachments of email. Click Yes to exit from the EDB viewer. To find particular files, use the search feature of E01 viewer. Select the folder to find particular file. Select the filter option to search email. Search the file by created date, modified and last access date. You can search email by its name and text. Click search icon. The search result. Click exit to close the application. Click yes to confirm the exit process.